gentlemen, my name is Kevin Fraser. Uh, I'm the saxo instructor in here at camp. Um, thank you for lending me all of these wonderful children right here. It's been a pleasure working with them, and it's been great watching them develop and grow with horn players. Um, to my left, this is... <clears throat> Jonathan Yeager. We call him Yeager. My name is Dominic Coletta. He plays the trombone, or the trumpet. Max Bogle. He plays saxophone. Daniel Friedkin. And he plays saxophone. Thank you once again. 2012 session five horn session. Okay. Oh, that was great. I enjoyed that. I don't know about you all. I, I was having a good time. Maybe you had to grow up in a black Baptist church to really appreciate that. I don't know. <laughs> okay. Hey, listen, I want to uh, show you something special. At least to me it is. Eight years ago when, uh, when Mickey and I started Chicago Joe's Rock and Blues Camp, um, we, I don't know, Mickey, what was it? Was it a grand total of maybe... 22 kids for the whole summer. All right, well, I mean, we, we, we're, we're somewhere around 22, between 22 and 30 kids for a session now. But we had 22 kids for the whole summer. Uh, Mickey's son, Jordan, who is here now uh, doing uh, the stage managing stuff and one of our young guitar instructors, and uh, uh, the drum instructor, uh, um, um, Zach, were one of our first campers, of course. Uh, but they long ago... <laughs> grew up and uh, went off to college and they've been, been junior counselors. There's one kid on this stage that has this sole distinction and a second kid on the stage who has a similar distinction. Uh, we, we, uh, we made the, uh, the age requirement something like, was it 11 to 18? Well, every now and then, and I, it's the same thing when, when, kids bring, when parents bring me a, a, a guitar, a, a kid uh, to teach guitar. When they're seven and eight years old, Sometimes their motor skills aren't ready, and I make a parent convince me that this kid is ready to start guitar. I said, you know, teach them piano and bring them to me when they're 10 or 11 and they're a little more ready. But every now and then I get an 8-year-old that's ready to do it. Having said that, I have seen a 5-year-old get up on stage, sit down with an acoustic guitar, and play me and Bobby McGee like any professional I've ever seen. It amazed me, and so I'm not a hardliner about, about the age thing because I know it can happen. Well... Uh, there's no kid, including Jordan and Zach, who have been at every single session. And it wouldn't be possible because both Jordan and Zach uh, aged out uh, at some point. But of course, there was one, a parent, who brought me an eight-year-old who already knew how to play his guitar pretty well. And so Mickey and I said, yeah, let's go on and do it. So he came and he did well, and he's been here every session. This is his eighth session. This is James Coldy. Coldy. <laughs> James had such a good time. The next year, he brought us his friend Griffin, who's been here for seven sessions. <laughs> and uh, these guys, as you are about to see, have developed into some fine musicians. They call themselves Gated Community. <laughs> Turn 
Dash Actor on the bass. We've got Jaeger on the drums. We've got James Colesby on guitar. My name's Griffin, and we are Gated Community. Take my hand and come with me because you look so fine and I really want to make you mine. You look so fine and I really want to make you mine. Four, five, six, come on and get your kicks because you don't need the money when you face like that to your honey. Big black boots, long brown hair, she's so sweet with that. Get back, Sam. I can see that you hold with me, but you were with another man, yeah. And I know we ain't got much to say before I let you get away. Gonna be my girl. So one, two, three, take my hand and come with me because you look so fine and I really wanna make you mine. Look so fine and I really wanna make you mine. Four, five, six, come on and get your kicks because you don't need a money with a face like that, do you, honey? Big black boots, and all brown hair. She's so sweet with that get back there. Well, I could see you home with me, but you were with another man. Yeah. And I know we ain't got much to say before I let you get away. Said, are you gonna be my girl?
ain't gonna give up on love Love ain't gonna give up on me on love Love ain't gonna give up on me Cause every tear that I've cried Only washed away the fears inside And I ain't gonna give up on Cause every beat of my heart Pounds with joy and in pain Cause every beat of my heart with joy and in vain And all those painful memories only brought me to my knees I was just gonna give up on love Johnny Taylor told me so So long ago What about the midnight crime Whoa, the cheating line What about the price that will Oh, surely be paid All those that gave up on love Love will surely find its way Just won't let me be
Again, I'd like to thank all you guys for coming. I'd like to thank you again for, uh, for loaning, you, loaning us your kids for a week. Some of you for multiple weeks. <laughs> thank you all very much. Um, I know that it's warm in here. I'm not going to make any long speeches. I've had a great summer. I've had a great time. I want to introduce my staff, and uh, I want to let you guys know that if you want to stick around, we'll, uh, we'll go upstairs where it's cooler. I know. I'm going to have a few beers and... Pat ourselves on the back a little bit. Y'all can come and, come and help us with that if you like. <laughs> All right, y'all, come on. Ah. <laughs> this is Mr. This is Austin Green, y'all. Guitar player extraordinaire. He used to be a little guy, but now he's taller than me. <laughs> Mike Katie, bass player. Not just a computer guy or a geek. Plays a little chess, but... Uh, He's our, he's our bass instructor. <laughs> this is Jordan Gonzalez. Again, one of our very first campers. Uh-huh, son to uh, Mickey Gonzalez. <laughs> oh, come on, Zach. Our, uh, these, guys, these guys came as, a, came as a team years ago when they were itty-bitty guys. And Zach didn't have any whiskers or anything like that. Zach has become a world traveler now. And if you want to, he can speak some Spanglish for you or something like that. <laughs> we got him back from Argentina safe and sound. Adrian Harvey, drums, keyboards. This is Avery Sieben. Ladies and gentlemen, Avery Sieben is our ultimate multitasker. Anything we ask her to do, she's right at it. She's on top of it. Plays bass, some guitar, sings. <laughs> Mr. Esco, watch this. Vedekvist, can you say that? Esco Vedekvist, 
He's also our drum instructor, but he's a, a multi-instrumentalist also. Helps the kids in each and every instrument. Ah, come here, Kevin. We couldn't, we, couldn't get, we couldn't get Will Scruggs this year, and Will Scruggs sent his understudy. This is Kevin Frazier, and he did a fine job with the horn section this year, did he not? <laughs> Logan Brammer, guitar player, plays a little ukulele and some other stuff, and uh, you can see that he's a, he's a chip off the old block like his dad. He's a great photographer. <laughs> and he's a, he's a pretty nice kid. <laughs> <laughs> uh, my bandmate, my good friend, hell, my roommate, my drinking buddy, Big Red Sergeant, y'all. 